Well, g'day everybody. Uh, welcome to Moxie Farm. So we would have liked to have flown everybody up here today to take a look around the farm, but obviously, you know, we're a ways away. So what we're gonna do today is take you on a bit of a virtual tour. We're gonna go in here uh, behind the scenes at Moxie and uh, show you a bit about what we do. So we're gonna do everything from uh, sowing some crops. We're gonna harvest some crops today. We might milk some cows. Uh, we're gonna load some trucks and we're gonna send it out this way uh, off the market. So why don't you guys come with me? We'll, we'll uh, enjoy the trip. Uh, as we drive along the top here, out to the left, we have the silage storage area. To the right here, we have the first of the freestyle barns. A thousand cows stored in each of these barns. So we're out here today spraying a paddock that's just been planted with corn. Uh, 30 odd hectares in it. Today we're planting corn, uh, it's P2307, we're sowing at 79,000 seeds, we're using Trimble GPS which is down to 2 centimetres accuracy, um, using an Orfman strip tiller, and the planter straight on the back so we can do one pass, put the urea down or UAN as we use them, the seed down and the third for the seed straight on top, so all in one go. Uh, here we are cutting uh, the loosen for silage. After cutting the loosen, we then merge it into one row. So we're mer merging the six uh, cut rows into one row. Hi guys. Today I'm going to show you how to feed mix. I'm going to put some citrus in the mixer first up. So what I'm doing now is I'm loading the citrus into the low end mixer. It's time to feed the cows. So I'm up the sheds now. I just want to make sure it's all nice and even. Good morning and welcome to Parlour 2. We're milking 1,300 cows here on an 80 stall rotary. We're running through is attaching the cups once the milk has been let down. And you can see the milk flowing out of the cups. And then if you turn around, you can see that we have a touch pad, which we can look at information about the cows. It shows us how much milk the cows have let down. And if we touch on a cow, we can actually see some information about her, such as how long she's been in milk for and how much milk she's giving every day. So we're around here at Cups Off. And once the cows are finished and the milk flow stops, the cup removers will take uh, the cups off the cow. As you can see, this one's about to come off. And that prevents the cow being over milked. 